Hello, Nico2064 here, back with another video. And today I'm going to make uh, my own custom Lego General Ross from The Incredible Hulk. Uh, he did appear in Captain America Civil War and uh, Avengers Infinity War. But continuing this Marvel movie trend thing, uh, I couldn't really think of anyone else to do from this movie, so I figured here's the best. Otherwise, you know. I guess I could have done, like, daughter, but she's confirmed to be dead after Avengers Infinity War with the snap. So anyway, now that I'm done, um, monologuing-ish stuff, yeah, let's get into this. Seeing as I have already used up half the video just talking about stuff, uh, just use gray legs. And President Business's um, torso with tan hands, which is the same thing I did for Donald Trump and um, Christopher Robin. Then this head, I know the facial hair isn't gray, even though it should be, um, but it came in a, the Mr. Freeze set from the Lego Batman movie, so that's where you can get that head. And on the other side, it has just a screaming head, which I don't know, maybe have him turning into the Red Hulk or something. Uh, and then this kind of uh, Widow's Peak hair in gray comes from Jay's father in the Jay's Lightning Jet set. And I believe it's exclusive to that set, so you're going to have to pick that set up. It's, a, it's been out for a while now, so it might be on sale somewhere. Um, so you could probably get that off eBay or something. Um, and I don't think the figure is too sought after, so should be able to get that pretty easy. So, here's my General Ross. Um, as I said, this is kind of the only character I can think to do. Um, and, spoiler if you haven't read Marvel Comics. He does turn into the Red Hulk, eventually. Uh, not in the MCU yet, but in the comics. Um, but I think the face kind of works. It's the closest thing you can do. And, if I could recolor hair pieces, like actually mold them in different colors, uh, they should have a light gray version of the Han Solo hair. It would really suit him, but for what I know, this is the closest you can do. And you can kind of see the back face get through, um, through the hair, so you might want to use one if you don't like that. But, yeah. I think he worked pretty well, and the suit definitely <laughs> suits him. So with that done, said and done, um, I'll end this, um, and the next movie is Iron Man 2, where I'll be doing, um, a certain minifigure, which you can guess in the comments. So, Nico Play 64, 